that's um my name is Stanis Stock and uh, I'm here from the uh, Rock and Pop Radio. Broken Pop Radio. Yeah. Broken Pop Radio. Yes. Um well um Tom, Robert, it's really nice to meet you. Um, you too. And uh well you have uh, we just have eight minutes, so I'm just gonna start with the first question. Um, well, without context, I would like to ask you first, uh, which is your uh, character favorite uh, line in this season Ooh. and if you can give us some clues as why without uh, uh, spoilers <laughs> now bear in mind Tony we shot this about <laughs> seven yeah. years ago <laughs> yeah about, about a year and a <laughs> year and a half year and a half was it if? about a year and nearly a year and a oh, half yeah. yeah what is it August now I like the one where um, there's there's a a guy from the Mothers of Agony, who's like a Hell's Angels mm. kind of crime motorbike kind of gang, and he says, "You know the vi the interest's been running, Klaus. You owe me forty grand." You know, and Klaus goes, "Listen, man. You know, we could stand here and debate dollars and cents all day long, but I think you and I both <laughs> know that I don't have your money, <laughs> and if you were to give me time, I wouldn't get it." <laughs> so. <laughs> So if you can find it in your dark black pagan heart to forgive, you know, and it and it was nice because in the scene you can see that both characters are having a laugh about about Klaus saying that. Mm. Like Quinn is the mother's of agony character. That's he's it, yeah, yeah. he's genuinely mm. having it. He's laughing at the the, the kind of um, uh, the gall, the cojones of Klaus for saying such a thing. Yeah, you, you remember it pretty well. Right now. <laughs> yeah, much better. I'm yeah. struggling to think of a line at all, other than I'm an exotic dancer. <laughs> Do you remember we're in New Grumpson, Maine? Yeah. We're in this little town in the middle of nowhere, a little kind of rural town. And you say something like... Do you think there's room for an exotic dance studio? <laughs> erotic dance. Erotic da dance studio in this town. <laughs> yeah. From the set of business. He loves New Grumpson. Yeah, some of us live Absolute there. Absolute gem. Be a stripper. Yeah. <laughs> Teach people how to be strippers in New Grumpson. That was quite funny. Uh, those are those are pretty what, what, good ones. Um, well, there is a scene where the cast is in a band, um, and oh, there's yeah. a song playing on repeat. And what were you thinking at that moment with that song? It's a child song. Oh, in the the Baby Shark. I'll be honest. I yeah. was, <laughs> I, I was <laughs> thinking. I was thinking. Um, uh, my toes are about to go numb here. Yeah, it was so cold. It was good. It was great laugh yeah. that day. We were on a little field trip up north of Toronto City, but it was in the dead of winter. Yeah, and really, really cold. Nearly got snowed off that entire shoot day because there was so much snow. Yeah, um, and they cleared a path for us to be able to shoot some of that that scene. But yeah, it was absolutely freezing. I, I remember I was genuinely feeling sick because I was in the <laughs> back of this van where the engine was a rear engine. And I was just getting fumes into my face uh, in the back of the van. So there was very little acting required for me. When I'm like screaming at five to like, open the window, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. like just to get some fresh air in. You're probably high as a kite. I was, yeah. I got out of that thing with a banging headache. Yeah. Oh. It was brutal. So it was actually a reality to it for me. This show, Tanya, took years off our life. <laughs> yeah, I, I noticed it. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, but What's your um, what's your favorite needle drop in this uh, uh, show? Why in the whole show? Do you, do you know one that pings yeah. to mind is when you <laughs> when Luther is a stripper and he's he's kind of at first he's a really crap stripper, but then something changes, kind of has something, up. and he kind of powers up and becomes quite a kind of a really good stripper. And everyone's like, wait a minute, this guy's got moves. And he's all like buoyed up on the confidence of it. And then you pull off your space suit and your monkey body has come back. Yeah. And it was really funny because it's just the scene of all these women really loving, <laughs> loving it. And then they all run screaming out of the strip club. And I've not just, noticed uh, that my body is like, so where are they going? I love that. You send them all running, screaming out of the strip club. <laughs> That was good. That made me laugh. Thank you. Thank you so very, very much for your time. Oh, thank you. Um, thank you, Tanya. So nice to meet, meet you and have a nice day. Muchas gracias. Adios. <laughs>